Hey, Roberts, Kevin Towns on HR. How you doing, sir? I'm doing all right. How about yourself? Doing well, doing well. You also see Eric is here on the screen. <laughs> hey, Robert. So uh, we set this up as an interview to follow up on the Employee of the Quarter nominees. And it is an interview, but it's, we've already decided who the Employee of the quarters, uh, Quarter is, and you're one of the two. So congratulations, Robert. We're very proud of you and well-deserved. Well, thank you so much. This is the point where we want to interview you, as Eric said, just so you can tell us more about yourself. So sure. tell us how long you've been with the city and tell us about your experience, where you started and what you are doing now. Well, I started 13 years ago. I was an intern with Ray Folia and uh, I only worked about maybe six times a month uh, helping him with the meetings and that sort of thing, maybe doing the occasional weekend shoot, but mostly just handling the meetings. Um, I graduated college and he put me on as a part-timer. And then eventually he decided to leave. Stefan came on, I worked under him. And uh, now he is gone, moved on to Barstool. And I have taken his place as the cable operations supervisor. Very good. So you hung with us a long time. Um, yes, I have. And, and, I, I've <laughs> really enjoyed uh, working here. Well, you've done a great job. And I, just to let you know, you weren't just nominated by one person. You were nominated by two of your colleagues. So Ooh. that's pretty special right there. It wasn't just one person that said, oh, Robert's doing a good job. It's, <laughs> it's two of the people you work with very closely. So uh, the other thing is part of how we select people we, may, we base this on is on our five key values, which is excellence, innovation, teamwork, integrity, and being action oriented. So you have exemplified that in your work. Uh, the people that nominated you saw that in you and the people that made the selection and reviewing the application and, and, and part of your story is, is why we're talking to you. So congratulations on that. Tell us about your job and what's the favorite, your favorite part about your job? Uh, well, my job is basically running the meetings for the cable and um, website. Uh, and uh, one of my favorite things I, I do is I get to have a lot of creative freedom when uh, I'm making videos or content for the city. A lot of what you see um, kind of has my own voice based on what I have learned throughout the years, whether it be college or uh, here. Um, it's kind of an accumulation of what I learned and what I'm good at and what I can bring to the city. And uh, it's, it's shown through uh, one, of, one of my prouder things I've done is the Fuller Story or um, Saturdays in the Park um, and just various things like that. I'm very proud of the Fuller Story though because it feels like I've really contributed to something that is very progressive within the city. And uh, even if I'm just a small part of that history. It, 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 it means a lot that I was even just a little bit part of that. Well, it's critically important that we communicate that to the broader community. So, you know, we can do a nice project, whether it's a park or a great community uh, project like the Fuller Story, but if our community and our citizens don't know about it, um, you know, they can't take yeah. pride in it and enjoy it and see it for what it is. So, thanks for helping connect our community to what's going on in, in yeah, so many absolutely. different ways. So, and, and I can tell you, Robert uh, and I work with, with each other at least a couple times a week, and uh, we always do the top three things together, and he's always got a great attitude, and is always uh, fun to work with, and, and just, uh, I add my praise to those that nominated you, and, and thank you for all you're doing. Well, thank you. This means a lot. Thank you so much. And I'll, I'll echo that, Robert. You, uh, you deal with Eric a lot. He's professional at it. You deal with me sometimes. I'm not a professional at it. And you seem to be okay with that. So I appreciate you. Absolutely, so, yeah. So t since your, your last question, let me just jump off of that. Tell me, what, are the, what do you like most about the city? What do you like most about Franklin, Tennessee? Oof. As corny as it sounds, this place feels like home. Uh, it, it really does. Uh, I've, I have a rooted history uh, in Franklin, my 
uh, father worked here for a long, long time. Um, I was raised here before I kind of moved around the Middle Tennessee area and eventually found my way back to Franklin and going on, and um, it just feels like, you know, I am I feel like where I, uh, I'm here where I belong. Yeah. That's great. Well, we're, we're so glad to have you as part of our team. And this is my favorite part of this, where I get to be like a game show host and kick it over to Kevin and say, Kevin, tell Robert what he's won. All right, Robert, you have won a $50 Visa gift certificate, gift card. Yep. You've won participation in a luncheon that's held annually that have all the other winners, plus the ACAs, Eric and myself. Your picture will be displayed in the middle of City Hall on the Employee Proudly. Board. <laughs> um, right across from your office, too. Oh, that's yeah. right. <laughs> <laughs> You'll get a special department announcement, and all this will be a sh showcased in the e-brief, on the City Hall Board, and in the outlying departments. Congratulations. Congratulations. Uh, yeah, thank you so much. <laughs> Robert, again, thank you for exemplifying uh, what excellence is about and what public service is about and uh, we're just really proud of you and thank you for the contributions you've made and will continue to make in the future in serving and connecting our community and the communication work that you do. So great job, we're proud of you and uh, keep up the great work. Will do, thank you so much. Good job.